So you clearly like voice to text on Evernote more than I expected. Let's do image to text next then. The moment I saw this tweet, I wanted to talk about it so badly, but I had other things to do. Okay, now I can. I'll start by showing you something that has nothing to do with Evernote, but has everything to do with the vision I have for this. This is my blogging platform. I'll upload this picture here now to show you what I mean. Stay with me, it will make sense, I promise. Okay, we have the picture here now to create a post, but let me show you this. If I click, this is in real time. I'll click here and take a look at this. A shiny modern escalator with a sign featuring a paw print, purple illuminated edges, and a distinct red stop button. This is amazing. This was in real time. And now if I copy the HTML text, I'll create a new post here. I'll paste that here. And as you can see, this is added to the alt text. What this means is that people who can't see, who are using a software to read what is on the screen, will have a description of this image. This is such an important thing to have in a website. I always try to add the alt text and I always struggle to create something as simple and as useful as this. Okay, remember that because I think this would change the way we search for information in Evernote. But before we get there, please allow me to talk a little bit about this other passion of mine. This post was created on my blog. It will be automatically added to some social media websites, and it is an activity pub post. Yeah, that's too much. <laughs> if you want to learn more about that, take a look at this other video. Okay, what we have here is the same picture the same description, I simply copy and paste it from, the, from the, the blog platform. I need this here for the demonstration, but I envision it in a different place. I see this description somewhere here, maybe here, the three dots, and I can copy the description. And also, this description needs to be a little bit more detailed. You'll soon understand why I'm saying that. Let's go to the search uh, everywhere. AI powered search and let's search for notes about okay that's pretty easy I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure it will get it here it is let's turn this let's make this uh, snippet to make it easier to see okay this is pretty easy I know this was gonna work because the way Evernote AI powered search works it's using the advanced search to filter some notes and then send those notes to the AI model and the AI model will bring back uh, the notes. So if we have this text in the note, even if it's not visible, and if the AI can read that text, wow, <laughs> we'll, we'll be searching pictures. I had in the past this client that needed to filter pictures based on colors. She was an artist. I don't remember exactly why she needed that, but let's say she, she needed to filter all the uh, pictures with the color yellow. And this was way before Google Photos or Apple Photos. And we created this solution in Evernote where she would add a picture and add tags, the colors, the main colors of that, pictures, that picture as tags. Now imagine, and I told her, I believe that someday Evernote will read the image and we'll be able to do it. But for now, the best option I can see is using tags. So let's imagine this was today. Uh, show me notes with the purple color. I'm pretty sure this is not gonna work because of the word color, but let's try it. Yeah, it didn't work, but if I do something like this with the word purple, now it found it. So this is what I'm trying to say. Uh, there, there has to be some adjustments 
in order for this to work. But can you see where I'm going here? Another example of context, that's a, a paw. So show me nodes uh, related to pets. I'm pretty sure it's not gonna work because there is no pet word on that note. But if I write something like pause, then we have it. Of course, this is just a hack and the AI is just reading the text, but I think you got my point. If the text has more details and if the text is sent to the model to be analyzed and maybe understand that Paul can be related to a pet or if there is a pat paw in the text, I think, oh, and, and try to guess that this is a mall or a store because of the escalator. I think this would make this kind of search, wow, <laughs> will bring Evernote search to the next level. Of course, this also comes with a lot of implications and I talked about it and the B-side video for supporters on Patreon and YouTube. If you are a supporter, you'll find the links in the description below. If you are not a supporter, please consider becoming one because it helps a lot. I would really love to see this. I even suggested this to uh, Dijo, the, uh, the, the co-founder of Voice Notes. You can watch that video here. I had a conversation with him. I checked Voice Notes they added a, they added support for images, but I couldn't find anything like this yet. So <laughs> let's see who's gonna get there first. If this one was helpful, I'd appreciate your thumbs up. And if you like what I do here, please consider becoming a supporter. Thanks for watching. See you soon.